I'd like to show you a couple of really neat features in Google Docs spreadsheet. One is to auto populate a list. Let's say I'm making a list of colors. And I'm just going to type them into my spreadsheet red, green, yellow, blue. But I need a lot of colors, and I either don't know a lot of colors or don't have time to type them all in. So I'm going to highlight the four that I've um, written so far, hold down the control key on my computer, and then click and drag. And it will automatically populate the selected files with various colors. Now this is not a perfect system. Um, sometimes it has some funny results. For example, let's try presidents. All right, we've got Bush, Obama, Clinton, Washington, Jefferson, Adams. All right, so we'll do that. Same thing, highlight, go to that blue square, hold down control as you click and drag, and we get a list. And some of these are good, but some of them are a little weird. Uh, we've got conservative, liberal, so it's not perfect. This is uh, an integrated search feature. Let me show you one more. Um, I'll show you how to to do one, and you'll be able to explore a lot more. I'm going to go up to, um, uh, first of all, I need a whole bunch of text. So I've just opened a Wikipedia page, just on presidents. I'm going to copy all of this, and just for time, I'm going to paste it right into there. So I've got a whole bunch of text in this column here. And I'm going to insert gadget. And there are a whole bunch of gadgets that you can use in a spreadsheet. I'd recommend looking through here. You never know what you might find. But I am going to use the word cloud gadget, which is um, pretty cool. Actually, I want to use this one here by uh, Seth Glickman. I like this one a lot. Let's say add to spreadsheet. And the first thing you need to do is select this column, which is C2. So I'm going to go here and say C2 and say apply and close and it will create a word cloud similar to uh, Wordle of the columns that I've selected. Now why would this be useful? If you've collected data on a survey and you've given a text box where um, your survey respondents can type in a lot of information, say in a, a research project, um, it's very difficult to pull out common themes from all of the responses. By creating a word cloud, you can see what words are used most common and uh, can be useful in pulling out um, what's important from all of those responses. You can ignore words that are uh, very common, like is and the, that type of thing. So this is one example of a gadget that you can insert into a spreadsheet. There are a lot more check through the um, gadget gallery and um, I'm sure you'll find something that you'll uh, have fun with.